All right, D&D sports fans, we got a new product unboxing for you. Stick around and check it out. Hey, D&D sports fans, welcome back to the channel. And you see something a little bit different here on the table today. Uh, one of my suppliers, I can also get uh, Lionel trains through them. And what I have here is the Gingerbread Junction. And I want to do an unboxing to give you guys an idea of what you get when you buy uh, one of these uh, kits from Lionel. So what this is, is it's a ready to run O-gauge train. It's got a puffing smoke unit, directional lighting with op operating headlight and backup light, and electronic steam whistle. So let's open up the box and see what you get here. All right, so here's what you get when you open up a box. You notice the uh, branding of the Lionel. There is one of the cars. Looks like there is another car underneath there. That looks like it's going to be maybe the pepper, peppermint stick train car. Here is the gingerbread junction caboose. There's some paperwork down there in the bottom. What this is, is this would be your controller. So that's really heavy, guys. Um, we'll open that up here in a second. I'm gonna assume that's track back there. And this one that you can't get into, or you can't see, is the engine. So let's see what else. There's a CD in there for something, getting started with Lionel. There's a whole pack of instructions. Let's pull this last box out, get this um, packaging box off the table, and uh, we'll take a closer look at what's inside these um, boxes with the cards in them. First thing we'll look at is the track, and in a common ready to run Lionel train set, you get a 40 by 60 oval. So what you will get here is there is four pieces of straight. They're just kind of stacked back to back there. Um, and in each one of these bags, you have four curves. First car we're gonna look at is actually the caboose, the back of the train. And like I said, this is the Gingerbread Junction, so it's got the Santa Railroad logo there in the middle. And the detail, this caboose. And the other side has the same thing. All right, let's look at Peppermint stick car next. The next one we're going to look at is a flat car with what Lionel is calling candy canes. Um, but they don't really have a curl on them, so they're kind of more of a peppermint stick. Um, but there is a ton of detail on all Lionel trains. If you notice, like the little wheel, just the paint detail. Lightweight. They just look like they're a, a heavier duty straw type material. There's a close up of the trucks. That's what the set of wheels are called. They're called a truck. And this next one is called the Gumdrop Gondola car. And you notice in here is four containers. Um, they're just going to be uh, basically a shell. There's not even a bottom to them. Pretty lightweight. And there's four of those in there. And again, back to the detail, you notice that even the paint, different colored gumdrops on it. All right, so this is what we've been waiting for. This is the engine unit. This is what uh, Lionel is calling a dockside switcher. Uh, 
uh, it would be wrapped in this foam container with a removable lid. Uh, now these are all steel. Uh, these blue ribbons are just what you can use to help pull it up out of the foam. So I'm gonna stop the video and pull the engine up out of there. All right, so here it is outside of the box. And the engineer in there. A little coal bay. Uh, there's a warning on here for uh, the smoke. So you put droplets in the smoke, which is actually in the container right here. So that's where you put your droplets. Use that to put droplets of smoke inside. Details of the front. This is a working headlight. Zoom in there. There's a, another person in there. This is all steel, so this is pretty heavy duty. Here's the underside of the train. An on off switch there for your smoke. The other side is a on off switch for the reverse. And behind that is an on off switch for the whistle. And those can all be controlled from the controller. So we will look at that. All right, with the engine set off to the side, the only other piece we got is your control box yet. So you just have your AC plug here, and this wire here connects to the back and then connects to the track. So that's how the signal gets sent from the control box to the track. Um, gives you your direction, your whistle, and your bell. And this is actually how you throttle, just by picking this up. And the further up you go, the faster your train will go. This, and the lower it is, um, it actually will bring it to a stop. And you can hit your direction and end up going in reverse, as long as you have your reverse turned on. All right, as you can see, it just fits on the table, the layout. So I'm not gonna run it too long because it's, like I said, it's just fitting on the table. But here it is all set up. Got the control box down here. And we will run it here in a minute. All right, guys, so there it was, a little bit of Christmas fun, the unboxing of the Gingerbread Junction Lionel train. Thanks for watching. If you like the channel, click the subscribe button, turn that bell on so you get notified anytime we release new videos.